Where are my soul sisters? Let me hear your flow, sister. Welcome back to my channel. It's your sister Union in the house today and I am back with a five minute review with Uni and it's been a long time. Today, as soon as I woke up, I just had to turn on the camera because I've been dying to use this product. Actually, one of my favorite brands I'm from has come out with a new sheet mask and I'm in love with their Mugworth line and they are finally here and i feel like i'm like one of the first people to you know review this on youtube so i'm super excited dun, da, da, dun, 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 da, da. as soon as i got back from the hospital we really opened the package that i received from i'm from skin and lab and chica y chico and they were sweet enough to send me a lot of like makeup products from chica y chico and some of skincare products from i'm from and um skin and lab so i was so excited as soon as i saw this i was like Oh my gosh, I have to use it. So I'm gonna shush up now and hurry up and try this bad boy out because I know that a lot of you guys are very curious and I'm gonna go into details of the ingredients like while I have the sheet mask on. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna open this bad boy up right now. I'm so excited. So they do have this tape right here that I'm gonna rip out. And it says Mugworth sheet mask, only one piece of nature contained and there's 10 sheet masks in this one box and in the back it says a little bit of the information it says it has 91.45% of the uh, Mugworth extracts let me see if that's the same as the the essence and for the essence it actually has 100% Mugworth extracts so it is a little bit less it's 91.45% and it also says i am from mugworth sheet mask contains every moment of nature it delivers effective ingredients to skin with the eye cell sheet for a sensitive skin filled in its own unique calming ingredient and purifying effects this is real essence sheet mask filled with mugworth essence extracted by slow release extraction method for 24 hours let your skin breathe free with 21.45% Kangwa Mugworth in the eye cell sheet. Experience nature as it is. Now, I've noticed that they keep on emphasizing a lot of the sheet itself, and I checked out their main site, and they were very proud of the sheet itself, that it's very, very mild for sensitive skin types and for all skin types, and it has been certified that um, uh, it can be used on babies, like the sheet itself, so I guess it's very, very mild. And they said to stick it to your forehead, nose, and uh, and chin in that order and then your um, uh, cheeks so I feel like probably the sheet will be very very thin and that oh, ooh, so it looks like this when you first open it I really love like how they have the little leafy uh, design to it and ooh, looking good i'm super super excited i just love the mugworth essence so much i've been in love with this i think this was like my number one for 2018 um if i could think of a new product that i fell in love with i really love that product so i'm so excited about the sheet mask so i'm gonna open this baby up and in the instructions behind it just says uh, exactly uh, what is said um on the back of the package so i'm gonna open this bad boy up Ooh, very easy to open some of them are like the plastic type like so it's really hard to rip but this is the paper kind of type so it's really easy to open and i heard that the sheet uh itself is environmental friendly too so after uh, you're done using it it can be recycled and it comes like this i knew it was very thin you know those like thin really um good sheet masks it comes with like another piece of something so making sure that it won't like crumble and things like that so a proper way to use a sheet mask i have a video right up there for y'all uh, is number one cleanse your face and number two use a cotton pad and use a uh, 
toner to wipe away any leftover residue or um, sebum or dead skin cells and then if you use it it's really good so what i love to do is usually you would put on the shin mask right off the bat but what i love using doing is getting the leftover essence first and putting it on my face evenly just making sure that everything is there because you don't want to waste it you know i mean you can uh put in a cotton pad in here and use it the next day too but what i love doing is i feel like this you get 200 percent of all the benefits of the sheet mask there's so much ample left I actually dropped it on the box right now. I don't know if you heard it. And this is the same, um, exactly same ingredient of the Mugworth that they used in the uh, Mugworth Essence when I checked it out in their site. They said it's the same Mugworth extracts. Okay, so now it's really for sure distributed evenly on my face. And then I'm gonna put on the sheet mask. This way I feel like you just get the whole effect itself rather than just putting on the sheet mask first and then trying to put on the leftover ample on the skin. So I'm gonna, they said to do forehead. Sorry about that, nose and chin. Make sure it sticks on. Oh, I love it. They did not disappoint. There are some sheets that feels really just kind of cheap or it's very irritating but this feels really good sticks on the wall to my skin perfect it's actually not the thinnest or the softest feeling of sheet mask that i've tried or the most cushioniest if that makes sense but it sticks onto my skin really well. Feels really mild. Perfect. And my ears are gonna pop. I dropped a big chunk. Eee! It's gonna go on my arm. Oh yes, it is. And with the, the leftover essence, I'm just gonna put it all over my scalp. Feeling good. I know y'all do it too. And like I've mentioned before, you can just pop in a cotton pad and seal it really, really well. You use it up the next day. I don't recommend that you keep it for a very long time because it's already open. So it says to take the mask off after 20 minutes. So I'm gonna actually wait 20 minutes. So while I'm doing so, I'm gonna chit chat a little bit with you guys about the ingredients that I looked up. So so I'm from has their official site. Uh, I'm from .co, uh, .kr. And I was so excited to find out that they're actually coming out with a few more products from Mugworth. They're gonna have a Mugworth cream and Mugworth spot gel. So I was like, Hallelujah, someone heard my prayers. Now I'm gonna share some of the main ingredients uh, that they have, which were on top of their list. And the first one is Mugworth extract. It has 91.45%, as I mentioned. And up next, they have butylin glycol, and it's commonly used ingredient that has multiple functions in you know um, skincare products, cosmetic products, including a texture enhancer. And one of our favorites, glycerin. And glycerin skin benefits are so much. There are so many different benefits that it has, but. Uh, mainly, it really helps to hydrate the skin and hold that moisture in. And one ingredient that I did not know about is they emphasized it on their site that this ingredient really helps with the mugwort to calm the skin um, intensely. And it was the Dongchung Hacho Chuchumur, which was in English cordyceps mushroom extracts, or they call it cordyceps extracts. And it is a really good ingredient for calming and also for anti aging as well. But for this this product, the brand emphasized that this ingredient really helped with the calming effect. And on their site, they also said like you can make this into a type of a container or something so that... Ah, okay, okay, so this is how they explained it. I think it's this. Oh, okay, so if you put it like this, you just take off the sheet mask like this each time. You don't have to close up the box, but 
You can just leave it on your desk or wherever shelf like this. Price on their site is um, 35,000 won. So that's gonna be about like probably four bucks per sheet mask. So it is not the cheapest sheet mask that I've seen, especially um, if I compare it with uh, some of the sheet masks that I've been using. I just wanted to show you, it's like right on my top shelf. These like, you know, um, in containers, like it's so much cheaper. So yes, if I do think about the price, I really want it to do like the money's worth. Y'all better do, you know, $4 money's worth of whatever it may be. But I'm super excited to see the results. So I'm gonna wait a little bit and I will see you guys. Okay, so I could feel it drying up and I'm gonna take it off always from the bottom to top. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Mm -hmm. First of all, I love it. I feel like I kind of drench the mugworth essence itself that i love so much which is so light and fresh but very hydrating and i feel like i just you know used it as a sheet mask and my skin feels so hydrated i really love it and i hate it when i use a sheet mask and it leaves like residues like and it feels so iffy and sticky like you want to hurry up and rinse it off but you should not rinse it off a lot of people ask me that like Sh can i rinse it off but if you rinse it off it's just like oh you know it's such a waste like the the reason you did it was to get all the juice and all the goodness in your skin but this feels so good my skin just feels really rejuvenated and calmed and um, it did not irritate my skin at all. So I feel like I can use it even when my skin condition is a really in a bad state. And it also, Mugworth is like the tea tree in Korea. It's, it's really good for acne care and calming your inflammation. My skin looks amazing. Skin just drenched that up right now. And my skin feels so good and light and fresh. Oh, okay, so before I rate that, my skin does feel like I need to put a cream on though. I don't think uh, it's like really hydrating to a point uh, where it feels really rich. Like I don't even need to put a cream on. I do feel like right now after I have soaked everything in and everything has soaked so well into my skin, I do need a moisturizer to finish off. Today I feel like I wanna use something a little bit more heavier than the Perito one that I've been using every single day. I'm gonna use the day cream one. A lot of people get really scared by the texture of this, the day cream one, but don't be scared. The day cream one, it looks like it's really thick it even looks like it has some type of white cast, you know? But it doesn't. I'll show you guys as soon as I do put it on. As I do put it on, it soaks right into my skin really well. Okay, perfect. Feels really hydrating and it doesn't feel sticky nor oily just feels really hydrated afterwards and this works really well under makeup too so i wish they would come out with the mugworth cream fast so i could finish off with that okay so now i'm ready to give it uh my rating ah personally for me i really loved it i really love the fact that my skin felt really deeply hydrated but it didn't feel sticky nor too rich or anything like that. It felt really, really fresh. Uh, but on the opposite side, I did need a cream to put on afterwards. I felt like after this, like it wasn't as hydrating enough for me to just finish off with this right off the bat. I did need a cream to finish off. For me, someone with um, sensitive skin type, with acne prone skin type, this is something that I would definitely reach out for very often. If I can, I would love to use this every single day because I think it mainly focuses on hydration and calming. And for those of you that have questions, if you can use a sheet mask every single day, I do have the answers for you guys in this video. So please check that out. 
with this one I feel like you can use it every single day and this is something that I'll be reaching out for no matter if I have a bad skin condition good skin condition if I'm breaking out or if I feel like my skin's really irritated or if I just need some hydration I would definitely reach out for this one but one thing that I have to be honest about is the price itself um, if I do calculate it it's 10 sheets and it's uh 35,000 won so probably with like it's about four bucks if you do calculate it in dollars so it will be not as affordable for me to be reaching out every single time so i will probably use this once or twice a week but i love it so much i love the essence and if you're looking for something that hydrates your skin that will really help with the acne prone skin that you have and especially because this is so mild it's something that i loved so much it was like one of my best discoveries in 2018 so i want to give it four four rainbows just because of the price itself because it's totally worth the money but i just feel like uh, i wouldn't be able to use it every single day which i would love to do because mainly it focuses on hydration and calming so four rainbows out of five all right guys so that is it for today i'm so happy that i'm from and the mugworth she mask did not disappoint because i love this essence so much so it has such high expectations and i'm so glad that i got to share with you guys if you have any products that you want me to review or check out please leave it in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe like follow me on my instagram and have a beautiful day today okay i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye-bye!